stated you would be donating half of the $7 million to the ACLU. That's correct. And you would be donating the other half to Children's Hospital of Los Angeles. That is correct. And you also stated, with respect to the $7 million divorce settlement, that money played no role except for the extent that you could donate the money to charity. Yes, that's correct. And you say this because you, quote, wanted nothing, end quote. That is correct. I wanted nothing. As of today, you have not paid $3.5 million of your own money to the ACLU. Yes or no? I have not yet. And as of today, you have not paid $3.5 million of your own money to the Children's Hospital of Los Angeles, correct? I have not yet. That's because you did want something, didn't you? I didn't want anything and I didn't get anything. You wanted Mr. Depp's money. You wanted praise for donating the money. You wanted good press. You wanted to seem altruistic publicly. You wanted to remind everyone of your claims of domestic violence against Mr. Depp, right? You wanted to make those claims seem believable. And to be seen, you wanted to be seen, excuse me, as a noble victim of domestic violence. I haven't been able to fulfill those pledges because I've been sued. You had all of the $7 million for 13 months before Mr. Depp sued you and you chose not to pay it to the charities you pledged it to. Is that I, correct? Ms. I Hart? disagree with your characterization of that. Heard had previously accused Depp of domestic abuse and got a restraining order against the actor in May. Heard said she has been a volunteer for Children's Hospital of Los Angeles for over 10 years and seen firsthand how more funding for staffing, better equipment and better medication can make the difference between life or death for a child. I know these organizations will put the funds to good use and look forward to continuing to support them in the future she said. Hopefully, this experience results in a positive change in the lives of people who need it the most. Let's look at your sworn testimony from the UK. This is uh, your third witness statement that you submitted in the UK action, right, Ms. Heard? Correct. And this statement was made under oath, true? That uh, is true. I'm directing your attention to the last page of that statement. That's your signature, right? Yes, it is. So you made this sworn statement on February 26, 2020. That's correct. And directing your attention to paragraph four, It says, quote, I remained financially independent from him the whole time we were together, and the entire amount of my divorce settlement was donated to charity, end quote. That is correct. Did I read that correctly? Yes, you did. Most of the money that was donated to the ACLU and CHLA in your name came from someone else. Isn't that right? I don't know what you mean by most of. Well, at least $500,000 that was donated to the ACLU in your name wasn't paid by you, right? Uh, I believe Elon made a donation in my honor on one of, you, one of the years. Yeah, and it didn't come out of your $7 million divorce settlement, right? No, nor did it count towards my pledge. It is correct that we received the 350, the 500, and the 350, and that we associated them all in some way with Amber. It does not list the 100000 Johnny Depp payment. Um, and we now do consider that gift as part of the um, constellation of gifts that are attributed to our relationship with Amber Heard. So that's how you would get from the 1.2 million to the 1.3 million, right? Yes, 700 plus eight plus one is 800 plus 500 is 1.3, correct. So the ACLU sitting here today attributes $1.3 million toward Ms. Hurd's $3.5 million pledge, correct? Correct. And at least $500,000 that was donated to the Children's Hospital of Los Angeles in your name wasn't paid by you either. Right, those were made at the same time. And it didn't come out of your $7 million divorce settlement. Nor did it count to my 3.5 obligation. Those $500,000 payments came from your new boyfriend, Elon Musk, right? Uh, he, I don't know if he was a new boyfriend at the time. You got him to pay part of what you promised to these two charities, didn't you? Incorrect. Because you wanted to keep at least some of the $7 million divorce settlement for yourself, right? You're very wrong about that. 
So after this December 2018 donation, has Ms. Hurd made any donations directly or indirectly to the ACLU? No, though those are the four contributions, the one that we've just the one four that we've discussed. Well, we're almost um, three years since her last contribution. What if any efforts has the ACLU made to get Amber Heard to pay? We um, reached out to Ms. Heard starting in 2019 for the next um, installment of her giving. And um, we learned that she was having financial difficulties.